Okay, so Ryan's getting some real nice mudding work done here on the sheetrock. So anything electrical come up for the near future? Not at this moment. Okay. Mm -hmm. See, it's important to go over it a couple of times, Dave. Yes. This way you get all the air pockets out. Yes. Now this can people make the mistake and they have pockets in their tape. Yeah. And they have to redo it or they have to cut it out. They cut job. Yeah. And they don't take the time to go over it. Which one? Getting the locks down. Always check your screws too. Yeah, make sure they're recessed. Now this camera doesn't have a pause, so it's not quite, it will look quite as professional as my other one that has a pause. But still, it's a pretty decent picture. Very important to make sure also, Dave, that you get your tape, that seam in it. Right. And the seam with a the seam that you're filling. And if you don't, it'll offset the mud. That's why you use a wider knife like this. Right. And the reason why you also do this. With, with the wider knife, this is it's less sanding you have to do it at the end. Right, because you get it nice and clean. I see I got it all nice and clean on the edges there. I hear we have a bad storm coming. Yeah, we're supposed to. And I always just tuck it into the seam so there's room. 
Alrighty. Yeah, it does. Very nice job. That's how you want to take. Alrighty.